got a six and a seventeen. Nice to have you. Chief, are you okay? Yeah. You sure? They said, yeah. What, you don't believe me? Sure. Sure, only, only, only what? You look like shit. I keep dreaming of the accident. And it's gonna be fine, Chief. Wait and see. It's gonna be up and out of that burn wood before you know it. What do you want, Cy? Michael called. He's on his way. It's going slow with the lawyers. It's a big day. It's a big divorce. Yeah. I'm worried about Michael. How so? I don't know. Maybe it's his splitting with Charlotte. But he's off his game. He's gonna be fine. Just like Eddie's gonna be fine. You're an optimist, sir. I guess so. I'm not. Is everybody else here? Everybody but Andre and Gaetano. They're late again? We're late again. Will you relax? I gotta get my car fixed. Andre, you got two speeds, work and worry. Yeah, yeah, I worry. I worry about getting fired, all right? I worry about not having enough money to eat, okay? About my sister's son needing braces. I worry. I worry about not being able to afford a carburetor, so I have to ride with you every morning. But you, that's all you talk about, the money. No, I talk about the lack of money, all right? I'm a New York firefighter, man. Which means I get paid less than the average messenger boy. Can you watch where you're going? Relax, take it easy. <sighs> you gotta get a life. No, I got a life, okay? And I like to keep it that way, thank you. Now, could you keep your eyes on the road and the hands on the steering wheel? I'm gonna take you out with me. This is a new dance club you're gonna love. I gotta get my car fixed. Could you slow down? How lucky are we? The precinct where I'm stationed is a half block from the firehouse where you're stationed. How many husbands get to walk with their wives to work every day? <laughs> About as many wives who walk with their husbands. <laughs> oh, there we are. Yep. You don't sound very enthusiastic about that. Oh, it's the barbecue. Huh? The, uh, the fire guys had to rip out their barbecues so the city could build this shed for the ambulance. Yeah, uh, so? Well, I'm told that the guys really love to barbecue. Kate, you're not making any sense. Hey, what's wrong? Kiss me.
Let's both quit our jobs and go home and have sex until we die. Okay. See ya. You guys see this? Due to the recent shootings of two of our men at fire sites, the department asked everyone to use extreme caution when out on a job, especially in high-risk neighborhoods. <laughs> Name me a neighborhood in New York City that isn't high-risk. Hey, did you say anything in that memo about how close they are to catching the sniper? The cops catch the sniper. <laughs> the only thing the cops can catch is a clap. Hey, I know a couple of detectives, Proby. They're pretty smart. Hey, guys. What's this? Chief's orders. You being the first woman we've ever had sleeping up here, she says this will give you more privacy. Oh, that's very nice. <laughs> Chief Shea, he's a real charmer. <laughs> Look, I know it's a tough adjustment for you guys. You know, having us EMS people just sort of shoved into your firehouse. So. Uh, don't bother me none, because it's not going to last. They're going to realize they made a big mistake, and they'll send you all back to wherever the hell you came from. Did anybody see Michael? He'll be here in a minute. Is it my imagination or has he been acting strange lately? It's your imagination. He's fine. Excuse me, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, do you mind if I come in for a minute? Feel free. Thanks. I went to see Adam McCarthy yesterday. The nurse wouldn't let me into his room. He's septic. Hey, that's our milk. Are you got to have some goddamn milk? Septic like a sewer tank? No, septic meaning his burns are infected. Skin graft might not hold. Yeah, I heard at the union meeting last night that the commissioner's gonna award Eddie the Harry M. Archer medal. What took him so long? Hi. Oh, Zalee, what are you doing here? Well, you said to come by that you show me around. So, uh, you gonna give me a tour? Yeah, sure. <coughs> <coughs> Um, can I have everyone's attention for a minute? Uh, Holy Mother of Christ Church is trying to raise some money for its summer youth program. So uh, we have, the paramedics at EMS have uh, decided to, to challenge uh, Ladder 60 Engine 17 to a, uh, a charity volleyball game. So um, I am just going to hang this sheet on the uh, bulletin board. And anybody who wants to meet the challenge can just uh, sign on the dotted line. OK, thank you. You want to play some cards? That's all right. Michael will play with me when he gets here. This is where we sleep. Oh. And which is your bun? Right here. Good old number nine. Number nine? Oh. Nice, I like it. It's all right. Come sit down. No, no, we can't do it. We can't do this here. We can't do this here. No, no, we can't. Yes, we can. Come on, come on, I gotta go. Oh, you do? Yeah, come on. Another night sleeping alone. Well, what happened to that girl you were going out with? What's her name? Tamara? Yeah, we broke up. Oh, now that's too bad. She was hot. Yeah, hot. yeah, you want to get out of here?
Oh! Oh! Uh. It's you. Yes, it's me. Guess those self-defense lessons are really paying off, huh? Yeah, well, what do you expect creeping up on me like that? I wasn't creeping. I was being romantic. I saw Cary Grant do a Tyreen Dunn in one of those late 40s movies. Yeah, well, you know, this ain't the 40s, pal. Look, you come up behind a woman like that these days, you'd be lucky to walk away with your manhood. These days? These days. I mean, can a man get a kiss or something? What's that about? Andre, I don't think we should see each other anymore. What? Why? No, 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 let me guess. Uh, I'm selfish. Pig headed. Indifferent to your needs. No. Okay, you're selfish, pig headed, indifferent to my needs. I can't live the life of a fireman's girl. I hate having you gone for days at a time. And more than anything, I hate. When I kiss you goodbye, I don't know if it's the last time. I'll see you alive. Look, I love you, Andre. Yeah. Look, I really do. But I can't live with the fear anymore. Women should be hunted. What? Hunted. Like wild animals. Women. They should be stuffed and mounted on the den wall. That's sick. You're a sick and twisted person. I'm only saying out loud what every male since Adam thinks in his heart. You don't think with your heart. You feel with your heart. You think with your brain. Only in your case, you don't. Guys think with their dicks. I'm sure you shuffle these. <laughs>